Before I start this rant, to anyone who likes last month, I respect your opinion. Anyways, enjoy. October 2021. Oh my god. The last month sucks. Now here are some bad things that happened last month. In my opinion. First. On October 1st. I went to school. After taking the bus back home from school. I played with Landon. Layla. And Ethan. Then I had game night with Christina and Stephanie. Along with Millie and Raymond. Later on that day. Stephanie and Christina were fighting. And then Raymond escorted Christina out of the house. But then it gets worse. Few minutes later. Christina went back inside my house and she started being homophobic and rude to Stephanie after she got so drunk. Second. On October 2nd. I spent the night at my aunt's house. And went to the Colorado Mills for my cousin's birthday shopping. Third. On October 4th. I woke up and I was getting ready for school. And went to the bus stop. While I was waiting for the bus. The bus flew past me and didn't stop for me. Then me and my mom decided to go to the park and ride. Then the bus came to pick me up and I went to school. After that. I went to homeroom. And I ate breakfast. A few minutes later. It was time to transition to math. And we started learning about fractions and decimals. Fourth. On October 5th. A lady who works at the Auraria campus that is sitting on the stairs of the Cherry Creek building yelled at me just because I was getting on my skateboard and she thinks I can't ride my skateboard on the sidewalk at the parking lot and she thinks there is a no skateboarding sign at the entrance of the parking lot where the cars pull in to park. Seriously, the parking lot does not have a no skateboarding sign at the entrance sign of the parking lot where the cars pull in to park. The sign is only at the entrance of the college campus and it is outside of the no skateboarding zone. Fifth. On October 12th. The fire alarm went off in the middle of lunch break at my afternoon class. And my friend Aaron claimed that he got bullied. So I decided to protect him from the bully. Now to skip to the part where I went home. After I got off the bus at my stop. It was raining. And I rode my electric skateboard going super slow. When I got to my neighborhood. Stephanie picked me up and got me a ride home. How nice of her. And then I changed to my regular clothes to go to Milliana's birthday party. And then I had fun roller skating. 6th. On October 14th. It was my last day of school to fall break. 7th. On October 15th. I went to a cool skate park in Frederick, Colorado. 8th. On October 18th. I went to a meeting with a doctor for social security disability and I did some fun tests with the doctor. 9th. On October 19th. I met with my social worker Mr. Adam. And me and Mr. Adam played Jenga. Then the fire alarm went off and we were having a fire drill at the school. 10th. On October 20th. I woke up and I was getting ready for school. Then I got upset because I got rudely woken up because I didn't turn my alarm clock off. Then I went to school. After that, I went to homeroom. And I ate breakfast. A few minutes later, it was time to transition to math. And we started learning about equivalent and improper fractions. 11th. On October 24th, I went to church. After church, I visited my uncle Aaron and Andy Marie. Including my god brothers Aaron and Matthew. 12th. On October 25th. The fire alarm went off at school. Again. It wasn't a drill on that day. It was an actual fire. But thank God my school didn't burn down. 13th. On October 27th. I had a bad morning since I was acting up. Then I went to school. After that. I went to homeroom. A few minutes later. It was time to transition to math. And we started learning about fractions and mixed numbers including decimals. After my classes, I went to McDonald's and then I went home early since my afternoon class was testing full-time kids. 14th. On October 28th, I woke up and got ready for school. And I ate breakfast. Then I got on the bus. The bus driver made my day bright. When the bus stopped at the railroad crossing, I saw a train. And I started rail fanning. Once I got off at my stop, I missed my second bus. 
Then I took off on my electric skateboard to the next bus stop and looked for a porta potty. Then there wasn't one in the abandoned parking lot next to the bus stop on South Main Street in Bromley Lane. Then I saw the bus on Highway 85. Then I suddenly took off on my electric skateboard back to the park and ride. Then the bus came to pick me up and I went to school. 15th. On October 29th, I went to my horse therapy class. And I was rail fanning before my class starts. Once class started, we did fun activities with the horses. After that, I took the N line to Union Station and I went to the bus stop to catch the 28. Then the bus came to pick me up and I went to school. I went to my afternoon class. And we had a fun pizza party. After school, while I was heading to the bathroom before going out the front doors of the school, one of the staff told me to pick up my electric skateboard and carry it with its front wheels off the ground while I was towing it on its front wheels. They should not have done that. What the staff told me made me upset. Once I got out of school, I got on the bus to come home. And when I got off the bus at my stop, I went home and I sat my stuff in my room. And I was getting ready to go to the trunk or treat. Once I got my costume and my stuff. I went to the trunk or treat with Stephanie along with my friends Miliana, Tatiana, Brianna, Kalani, and Lena. Then we had a fun game night. While I was playing soccer with Kalani, I fell on the rocks really hard. And I got a cut on my knee. 16th. On October 31st, I went trick or treating and I got a truckload of candy. And then I had game night. Then the plan of doing my Halloween makeup has completely failed. And I washed off the makeup. Can't this day get any worse? After that, I played a game of Uno with my mom, dad, Miliana, Stephanie, and my god brother JJ. And then I was thankful that my aunt delivered my Halloween bag and my hygiene bag. And I was very thankful. Once I got back inside, I continued playing Uno. Then I won. Then I went outside of the garage to walk around. When I was about to head back inside, I got in a lot of trouble for going outside when it's too dark. And I got in a lot of trouble for pouting over simple and small things as well. I almost got forced to sleep outside and go to the bus stop myself for school. I should not have done that. I didn't want this day to be like January 26, 2010 all over again. Then I started crying and I felt ashamed for what I did. The only thing I like about October 2021 is playing outside with all my friends. Playing with Millie and Stephanie, and my other friends. Playing with Zachary, Bryn, Emilio, and Nicole. Automotive class. Riding the bus to school. Riding the bus back home. Playing soccer. The bus drivers making my day bright. Rail fanning. Trick or treating. Game night and also riding my electric skateboard and also playing with god brother jj and that's it thank god the last month ended on october 31st 2021 at midnight and thank god it's in the past now do you know who likes the last month angel bonilla and miliana stab they like this month because their birthdays landed on this month angel turned 19 and millie turned six years old this month but I can handle their opinions. Do you know who hates the last month? My best friend Aaron Vietz. He hates this month because he got bullied on this month. October 2021 sucks, and so does January 28, 2020. Note. If you like this day. I respect your opinion. July 14, 2009. Which is the day I turn date. Is 150 million times better than October 2021. End of rant.